Hey, Shalom, Shalom, Shalom. Hey, first and foremost, as always, I would love to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rakakwadash. Hey, double honors to the apostles and elders, a great millstone that taught us this truth. A hey, blessings and safety to the elect. All right. And um, this is an article that I came across from the New York Post. It says 83% of tattoo ink contain hidden ingredients linked to cancer and organ damage. All right. You know, nothing should surprise you at this point. All right. Because we know who we're dealing with. We're dealing with Esau Edom. Okay. The damn devil. Okay. Which is our enemy. Okay, and, you know, getting tattoos is a heavy demon amongst Israel, man. All right, but before I get into that, okay, I wanted to read this term slow poison, okay, because this is a method that he used, okay, to pretty much, uh, uh, you know, destroy the people, okay? It says slow poison refers to a substance that causes harm to the body over an extended period of time, often without immediate or obvious symptoms. This can include various toxic substances such as heavy metals, certain chemicals, or even certain medications when taken inappropriately. The effects slow poison may not be immediately noticeable, but over time, it can lead to serious health issues or even death, all right? So that's the term, okay, that, that, that Esau used, that slow poison, okay? So that, because hey, if he was to put, you know, a, a, a harmful chemical in something, let's just say food, and you would eat it, okay, and right away you were, you were, you were to get symptoms, then, you know, he would pretty much be the bad guy, you know, you could point finger to him, you know, you could point the finger, hey, man, this happened to me when I ate this, man, you, you're the, the, the perpetrator, you know, so he used, he, he uses that method, that slow poison method, so that it won't be tied to him, okay, and then he'll tell you, oh, it became, it's because of this, and then you'll pretty much take that and run with it, man, you know, but hey, you know, let's just read a little bit of this article, it says, Americans are unwittingly exposing themselves to tattoo inks that contain organ damaging chemicals disturbing new research had revealed and guess what man <laughs> you know hey the lord commanded us not even hey we ain't even supposed to be getting damn tattoos man you know we are not supposed to get tattoos man see that's the thing man the lord has given us a law man okay not only to you know, make us, you know, wise and understanding people amongst these other nations, according to uh, Deuteronomy, the fourth chapter. But also, you know, keeping the law, it, it, it brings life. OK, and when you turn your back on the law, OK, that's when death enters. Matter of fact, this is going to be a quick hit, man. I'm going to get a few precepts and I'm going to close out, man. Uh, let me get a quick precept. Uh, this is Baruch chapter four and one. It says this book. This is the book of the commandments of Yahweh and the Lord that endureth forever. Okay. And we was just going into that at cap. How, you know, uh, the Christi, Christian church, man, Christianity. Okay. They promote the law being done away with. Okay. They promote, you know, that the Lord, he loves the sinner, but hates the sin. Right. They promote that. Okay. And. They also, you know, they, they don't promote the Old Testament, you know? That's why we call them New Testament Christians, all right? Well, the Old, the Old Testament consists of what? The law, the Torah, the first five books, right? The Old Testament also consists of the Lord's judgment, which they don't want you to, to, to remember those things, man. And that's ultimately, you know, you know uh, uh, E, okay, and his doctrine. Okay, but it says, this is the book of the commandments of Yahweh and the law that endure forever. All they that keep it shall come to life, but such as leave it shall die. All right. 
And like I said, man, yes, yes, we, it's some brothers, you know, in the truth, man, they got tattoos, but once we came into the no, okay, of, 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 of it being off, okay, we don't get them no more, okay? But like I said, this, this tattoo demon is heavy amongst Israel, man, especially when someone died, man, okay? And the scriptures forbid it, matter of fact, because we don't have to, you know, read no more of the article. Okay, but this is Leviticus chapter 19, verse 28. It says, and ye shall not make any cuttings in your flesh for the dead, man. And Jake do that at an all-time high, man. You know, soon someone die, man, they run to some damn tattoo shop and get and get and get them tatted. You know, they get the tombstone, the day they was uh, born, and then they get the day they died, man. You know, you got Jake, man, as soon as Big Mama passed away, Jake can't wait to run to some tattoo nigga and get tatted, man. Well, it's off, okay? Let's read it again. Leviticus 19 and 28. See, you people don't understand that the Bible, you just think the, think of the Bible as just being some book that's, that's not up to date, man. See, the Lord already know what you niggas was going to be doing in this time, man. If there's nothing new under the sun, the same things that were taking place then, they're taking place now, okay? So it says, and ye shall not make any cunnings in your flesh for the dead, nor print any marks upon you. I am the Lord Yahweh, man. So you ain't supposed to be printing no marks upon you, man. Let alone you, you, you're, you're putting, you know, this ink into your body, man, your body, which is the temple of the Lord. This is where the, 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 the spirit of Yahweh Shimei Shah dwells man but here it is you look you niggas putting poison in you, in, in you man look 83 percent of tattoo ink contains hidden ingredients linked to cancer and organ damage man and like i said esau uses that method slow poison man all right so you you know you may be injecting these things in you okay at an early age but once you get to 50 you know, 45, 50, 60, you wonder why you got organ failure, man. You know, you wonder why you have cancer, okay? Or eat your worst genetics, you know, the, the genetic leak, all that nonsense, man, okay? He he falsifies things, man. That's when you go into the word, doc, he's falsified, man, okay? He's a physician of no value, as the scriptures say, but... You know, this, hey, man, the Lord tell, the Lord ain't just telling us these things just to tell us, man. He, he's, he's letting us know for a reason, the way of the heathen, okay, the way of the heathen is death. The way of the heathen is, you know, contrary to, uh, to the way of Yahweh Shem Yahweh which I do believe that, uh, um, tattoo, tattooing, uh, uh, goes back, I, I believe it's an, it's an Egyptian custom. You know, if I'm not mistaken, okay, you can, you know, you can fact check that, okay, um, but, you know, it's a heathen custom, you know, it might not be Egyptians, but it's a heathen ch a custom, like I said, you can fact check that, you know, so we're, we're not to, you know, pretty much partake in that, okay, and we're gonna uh, go to 2 uh, 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 Corinthians Well, first Corinthians. All right, this is the book of First Corinthians three and um sixteen. It says, Know ye not that ye are the temple of Yahweh, and that the spirit of Yahweh dwelleth in you. And if any man defile the temple of of, of Yahweh, him shall Yahweh destroy, for the temple of Yahweh is holy, which temple ye are. So hey, you're the temple of, of, of Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shah. Okay? So, hey, any, it says any man who destroy that temple, him shall Yahweh destroy, man. All right? But you got niggas out here that, oh, man, tattooing, man. Why would the Lord care about a tattoo, man? Hey, the scriptures say there are a way which seemeth right unto a man, uh, but at the end of all the ways of death, man. You know? But, hey, this is more of a reason Okay, because hey, the first reason is because the Lord said not to. But this should be more of a reason why you niggas out there shouldn't be getting tatted up, man. All right, 
But, you know, hey, you know, I hope this was edifying. You know, I want to uh, end giving all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakakwadash. Uh, Till next time, Shalom.